everyone welcome back i am so glad that you're here and you keep coming back watching my videos i called in this morning and i don't get in trouble for that as i said in the past i use my pto and we don't get points against us or anything but i woke up really exhausted i mean tired I actually felt slightly dizzy and I think I've had some active vertigo only when I kind of go to bed and turn completely around you know you crawl up in bed and you want to roll on one side well I start spinning and I'm like great so I'm hoping it doesn't kick in uh, I got my stress test results in today and I can't make heads or tails out of it it looks like on one hand, it looks like things are bad and I Google it and it says it's bad, but I haven't heard from them just yet. And I, I guess I'll wait another day. It was uploaded this morning. It's been a unproductive day. I don't know, <laughs> unproductive day. I have just been sitting around doing nothing. I got on my computer a little bit. I was going to see if I could hook up my Apple phone to my Hewlett Packard. Cause I know you can hook it up and transfer files and stuff in which I was going to do. That part can't happen. But if it can and you know how, let me know because I don't know how. Because I'm wanting to transfer my videos to my computer, to my editing software, which I feel is better than iMovie. And I just can't do that. But, once I'm done with this video, I can upload it to the computer. I don't know if I'll do that Monday through Thursday, knowing that it's going to take a longer time to edit. And I don't have time for that on those days. But just now noticed that it's 526. So I don't think I will hear anything about my test until hopefully tomorrow. And in that video, I will let you know. It says that I have left valve. Let me pull it up. I don't know if you just heard that car being as loud as it is starting up. But that sucker's loud. Sometimes I jump out of my skin if it's close to my apartment. Okay, it says hyperdynamic left ventricle function with an estimated ejection fraction of 97. What I've been reading online, that's bad. <laughs> it's pretty bad. And then it says, it is likely that the left ventricle systolic function is grossly overestimated giving the small cavity of the left ventricle. But the other two, this three, and that one sounds bad. The other two sounds normal. Now watch me have it backwards. Knowing my luck, I have it backwards. I Googled that and it's supposed to be for women my age, no higher than, I think it said, high 50s or low 60s percent. Mine's 97. But the lower it is, and there's a number, I can't remember that number, but below, the, I think it's 50. Below that means that you're, you're fixing to die. <laughs> it's like um, heart failure, that you're going to be unalived very soon. The one I'm in can weaken your muscles over a short amount of time, scar them, and they'll be unrepairable, of course and then you can go into sudden death. But the last time I researched that with the monitor I wore, that, the what I researched said the same thing, that I would be in, I, well, I can, um, I can have sudden cardiac arrest or sudden death with the PAV, PAC and PVC, which mine is more PVC heart issues. And they said, oh, you're fine. That's normal. Having 30 a, a day or more of that is normal. And I'm like, that this cannot be normal. It sounds like it is damaging. 
your heart's doing something it's not really supposed to be doing. So I'm dumbfounded. I hope I get a doctor's input soon. I will go to work tomorrow because I do need to accumulate more PTO in case my vertigo kicks in and that scares me to death. The last one was five days. Now I saw that one with my naked eye and I am starting to see the orbs with my naked eye. And it's funny, because, and I got distracted on my, my talk, I'm sorry. But it's funny because when I see them with my eyes, they look different. They want another one. That is so weird. It looks like a tiny itty bitty water bubble. But on the, the camera, they look bigger and white and, you know, kind of clearish. And it's funny because they'll come right in front of me and get my attention and then kind of drift off. I had two of them since I said I saw that one. I don't have dust floating in the house. I have no bugs because they spray all the time. And I'm clean, so there's no bugs. There's no gnats. There's nothing like that. I mean, if there were, you would see them constantly. And as you can see, you know, I, I don't have any. Those flowers right there, I have got to throw away. I've been here a year next month and I have nowhere to put them. And I've been needing to throw them away for a while. <laughs> and here I am saying, I'm not dirty. I don't, I don't hoard stuff. Oh, well, I don't always look at the, the glass I don't know what you would call it, the um, the glass part of the cell phone where your apps go. I don't know what you call it. Um, I always look at that, <laughs> the uh, lens. Is that the lens? Oh my God, I feel stupid. But that's where I look at because you're supposed to. And I feel that if you're looking at yourself like this talking, I feel that people feel I feel that people think that you are um, all into yourself kind of thing. And I don't like looking at myself too. Not even in a mirror. And when I put my makeup on, I'm focused on specific things. <laughs> so I always look at this. And that way you'll know that I'm looking at you. Or I hope that you think I'm looking at you. Today is a good day. Um, oddly enough, it seems like here lately, I'm feeling more spiritual every day. And I'm not talking about, you know, I'm going to preach God's word to you, anything like that. It's um, for myself. I think I saw another one. I'm not sure. And, you know, if, if anybody approaches me and wants advice about anything, I will, I will give them advice. Whether they take it or not is their path of course but all day today words have been going through me saying i walk with yahweh i walk with um what did they call jesus i went completely blank i i know yes yes -a yes -a yahweh and i can't remember i know you know if you know comment below this will be a good time to get comments comment below what did they call jesus it wasn't jesus it was i cannot remember i'm gonna just mm. and then anyway i walk with yahweh which is god's source um jesus but with his real name uh buddha and What is his name? I've, I've been thinking about it all day. The, um, the Indian, uh, hi, hi, the master, a high master, a spiritual master. Um, <laughs> I hate this. What was his name? It starts with the S I think. I'll come up with it eventually, but I have a feeling that you know what I'm talking about. But that has been going through my head all day, and I'm like, okay, I get it. I'm walking with them. I'm close with them, and I have a feeling it was going through my head because they're around, and in which I've been trying to draw them to me 
to guide me and help me, I guess. I'm having very, very few minimal visits lately. I don't know why. My room filled with a film the other night and that was it. I saw beings kind of moving around in the film. Remember the film I would touch and I, it would peel off on my fingers and it would be kind of crunchy and you could feel it. it I feel that it's something they had to put in the room for them to enter. I might be completely wrong. But that's how I feel because I will see that film before I see them. I don't know. So I wanted to update you on the heart stress test thing and talk to you a little bit. And you have homework to do. Put a comment on the two names that I, I'm supposed to know. Yes, Awa? Yeah, yes. I, now, when I'm done, watch. I will be editing this and I will come up with those names. Okay, anyway. <laughs> I love you guys tremendously. If you see orbs, count them and let me know how many you see in my comments below. Because the other day when I was doing the video to my mom, I don't know if anybody noticed and I was going to put in there at the end how many orbs I've seen, but I forgot. But while I was talking about it and I was stating what entities were around me and behind me, then I had an orb shoot up from my head, it looked like. And I think it was around the time where I said, I think Aunt Linda is here. I'm not sure. But anyway, I'm going to end this here. I love you guys so, so much. And let me know those names. <laughs> I'm sending you love, light, and peace. Bye. Thank you.